Well, he ever told the House of Commons that kids are begging Santa for food, and then he literally voted against a national school food program for children. So let's take a look at this article by Jason Pugh from Cryer. In the House of Commons, Pierre said, we have stories of children who are writing letters to Santa Claus not to ask for presents, but to ask for food. So it's a good thing that the federal government is introducing Bill C-322, which will create a framework to establish a national school food program. For context, Canada is the only G7 country in the world without a national school food program. This is a failure that Canada has been facing for decades as our peers have been doing this for a long time. And we're 37th out of 41 of the wealthiest countries when it comes to feeding school children. So what did Pierre and the Conservatives do? Every single one of them voted against a national school food program because they only care about hungry children when they can use them as the weapon against Trudeau. They don't actually care about feeding hungry children. And when it's pointed out to conservatives that they literally voted against a bill that will feed children, they say that the bill will feed more bureaucrats than kids. What is your logic there? Are liberals just going to march into schools and steal lunch from children? That's the thing. There is no logic behind their decisions. Their only goal is to paint Trudeau in as bad a light as possible and to get elected, even if that means voting against children getting free lunch. It's not like kids need to be fed in order to learn to the best of their ability, and it's not like it's the government's responsibility to keep people safe and healthy. You know, just that's obviously not what the government's for. The free market should be stepping in and dealing with this. That's what I assume Pierre would be saying, considering the fact that he voted against giving free food to children.